I love horror films with children because I think the dichotomy of the dangerous and the innocence of children tends to work really well. So I was really looking forward to Children of the Corn and it's absolutely appalling. This was released in 2020. It's directed and written by Kurt Wimmer, based, of course, on the story by Stephen King. And I have seen the 1980s version. I don't remember it enough to be able to compare it. But I can say that this one is not as good at all. And I'm I'm really disappointed by that because I had really high hopes for this, despite the fact it only has 3.7 out of 10 on IMDb. And that's across 4.3 thousand reviews and ratings. Usually when something on IMDb has a low rating, I don't think it deserves that low rating. Honestly, I'm on the fence with this one. The acting is okay. The music is okay. The concept is absolutely fine. But nothing about this works well. And to be honest, while the concept works well, it's about children who punish and kill adults who made a decision that they're not happy with. I won't spoil it too much, but it revolves around this cornfield, just in case you do decide to watch it, or indeed you watch another version or you read the novel. I don't want to give away too much, but I think it's an interesting enough concept. And this one basically doesn't do a great job of telling this story. I've never read the novel, so it could actually be word for word identical with Stephen King's novel. I doubt it. But the point there is that I can't say it's a bad adaptation because I've never read the book. But I will say that there were a lot of things in this narrative that just didn't make a lot of sense. There were a lot of things in this that are unbelievable, even within the context of the narrative. And I just found it to be really dull and not scary. There is not one single horror element in this at all. And it definitely relied on the shock factor of, look at these sweet, innocent-looking children doing these horrific things to adults. But unfortunately, that just fell flat as well. So the narrative is kind of poor. Again, I can't compare it to the novel. I'd hope the novel is better. I'm assuming it is. But if anybody has any thoughts on that, please feel free to let me know. But the narrative is otherwise very dull. And the characters are not interesting. There is no horror in this at all. Honestly, I'm struggling to find any redeeming qualities in this. As I said, the performances are okay. The music is good. The camera work is fine. But the narrative doesn't work and there is no horror in this at all. So I don't recommend it. If you're interested in the story, I probably would say watch the 1980s version. But as I said, I don't remember it enough to be able to say how good it is. I might have to revisit it at some point. But either way, I don't recommend the 2020 version. Unless perhaps you don't like things that are very scary. Because there isn't any horror in this at all. So maybe it could be an entryway to see how you deal with things that are, in theory, quite creepy. But in execution, not so much, to be honest. I'm trying to find an audience for this. And honestly, I'm struggling. If you're not a horror fan... I still don't think you'll care for it. If you're a horror fan, you're not going to care for it. Unfortunately, I had really high hopes and it just didn't come even close to meeting them. Children of the Corn is not a good film.